Hi everyone, I'm hopeful that all you will be fine. In this session, I will show you how you can actually enable the Geld review within your web SDK integrations. Okay, by default, when you are going to integrate the web SDK, there is a no any by defaultically enabled Geld review. Okay, so you can see here I have already enabled on my local host for 4000. I have enabled Geld review, and once you have enabled the Geld review, you have this view option, and from here you can select any value either you can switch to speaker view either you can switch to gallery view okay so now let's start so for enabling that we have four different options either we can enable the gallery view by enabling the cross origin isolation okay either we can enable the gallery view by using credential less headers either we can enable that by origin trials and last option so i have a, this script File. you just need to uh, upload that file to some CDN and just load that file inside the script tag inside your page and you will be have a gallery view for option number four script option is is more uh, suitable for the codeless platforms okay you are either you are using squarespace sites where you do not have any way to enable the headers credential less headers then you can just need to load this uh, script directly inside the page using the script tag and then you will be have a gallery review inside the web SDK integration option number four is more suitable for these type of a platforms okay i will upload that file inside the video description section you just get that from there okay so now let's start how we can actually enable so we first need to stop the api and we need to close the browser and now we need to start it once again Okay, we need to open the browser once again and we need to open that in a private mode and here we need to load the same URL. Here you can see we do not have a view options and we do not have a gallery view inside this page. Okay, so you can see also inside the console when you are just typing here cross origin isolation then you are getting false the cross origin isolation is not enabled on this page that's why you do not have a get review here okay now let me get back to the server and we need to here first enable those headers so we say ape.use and we need to bind the handler request handler so we say request response next okay now just define the definition I'm using express.js so that's why I'm just setting inside the response.save it will be totally depend on what technology or what platform you are using so you can set these two different headers there okay as I am setting okay you just need to set cross origin embedder policy and you need to set this to value require or okay so first header is that and second header set cross origin opener policy and you need to set same origin okay you needed to set these two different type of headers on your server side and you have a gel review inside the web SDK integration okay so the first option is that cross origin isolation okay so these are the two different type of headers you need to enable to achieve the gel review for the option two, the credential less headers, you just need to change this required cop value to credential less. Okay. And that's it. I'm just using require cop C O R P and we need to format the code. For the option number three, origin trials, you just need to navigate to the developer.chrome.com and origin trials and just navigate their shared array buffer you can see uh, you need to register your site URI okay and option four is you just need to upload the file and just load that file in a script tag okay like this script tag and you set the source your CDN will be here where you have uploaded that file and just name the file so ciosw.js and that's it okay so option four will work like this okay now we need to restart the api we first need to stop that npm start 
before that you must be have this next called at the end of this ape use middleware okay as we have passed the handler and you can see i have a call next middleware at the end if you are using express js also okay so now we just need to navigate to the browser once again and we need to reload and we need to open the console and here we just need to type cross origin isolation and you can see we have enabled that true okay now when you navigate to the meeting and inside the meeting you will have a gallery view you can see now the options are visible and once you click on gallery view you will be inside the gallery view okay now you can see you are inside the gallery view you can change to speaker view this is a speaker view now switch back to gallery view you can see you are inside the gallery view. okay i'm hopeful that you have enjoyed this session if you have any query regarding this session then just please place your queries inside the video comment section either you can share your queries and suggestions for my share contact details hopefully we will come back with another session take care bye bye